So you know what? I actually believe in this theory. And by the way, guys, this is a clear joke. Okay, don't take it seriously. So what I believe is, uh, people who score 80, 90% or who come first in the class or in your academics, they become employees. All right, and people who come second in the class, they actually become managers. Right. So the people who uh, and and these employees will report to the managers and then the people who come third in the class they become owner of the company where managers will report right and the people who fail in class they actually own the building where this company guy purchases the place to run the company i think it's a funny thing and i mean it's a real funny deal with the way this world works Welcome back guys Arun this side and this special episode this is also a DBA challenge episode where i would like to challenge all of you you who's listening to this show and that's the beauty about daily dba show guys like i'm liking it the way we are including challenges and the way you all are commenting below these videos awesome right so that being said today's episode is special why because this is episode number 30 so each episode which ends with a zero like episode 20 i mean i know we didn't have a dba challenge but i guess oh, somewhere in episode 17 we had a dba challenge but going forward every 10th episode like 30 40 50th episode we will keep it as a dba challenge where i will ask you questions and I won't be taking your questions in these episodes. So what's the DBA challenge that we have for this episode? So guys, understand everybody is running behind cloud, right? So everybody wants to migrate to cloud. I'm talking about clients. All the DBA wants to become migration experts. Amazing, right? But I have a quick question for you. See, one of the rather than Okay let me give you a concept and then we'll talk about the dba challenge so what are the ways you can migrate databases to cloud right so one of the simplest ways is export and import right so exp imp this is the first method the next method is data pump so you can use export import data pump to export from your physical server import it into the cloud right what are the next ways you have rman right and in armen you also have transportable table spaces armen cloning armen duplicate you can use whichever method you want to apart from armen the next method is data guard perfect and apart from data guard we also have golden gate right awesome so with these many methods that we have to migrate our database from physical to cloud my question is on data guard okay this is for everyone come this side all right so my question to each one of you is see in data guard you have two servers right this is physical and we have one more server in cloud right so this is your application server application server is pointing to the physical server where you have physical database oracle installed and now you are using data guard to perform the migration so what happens in data guard you create a standby database in cloud and you have a primary right so you have a primary database on physical you have a standby database on cloud now what you do is you perform a switch over so you switch over so this becomes your standby and this becomes your primary perfect so now that you have the primary server on cloud migration is done one of my biggest questions is how would you point your app to the primary server which is in cloud with zero downtime that's your daily dba challenge and that is what i want you all to answer one more time if you didn't get this question you have a primary server you have a standby server we have configured data guard primary is on physical the standby is on cloud and i'm using switch over method to perform the database migration database migration is done awesome now you have an application which is already pointing to your primary server right 
but this primary is now converted into standby so how would you point your application automatically to the cloud or the primary which is on cloud with zero downtime like you are not allowed to shut down the application you are not allowed to make any changes to the application so how would you achieve this this is your dba challenge and guys listen these kind of challenges we deal when we are working on clients databases and we have to design solutions in order to solve these problems i would love to hear from all of you like what's your strategy in order to achieve this and meanwhile keep commenting send me your queries to support at dbgenesis.com and let me try to bring more challenges to all of you so that we all learn together that being said guys i'll meet you all in the next episode bye